Side of Dennis Lilly measuring out his run, warming up, ready to take up the fight. And if West Australia are going to get up at all, it's going to be through the strong right arm of Dennis Lilly. But it's Dennis Lilly to Viv Richards. The man that he really wanted to get out because of the way he scored his runs, how quickly he scored them, was Viv Richards. So it became a battle between Viv Richards and Dennis Lilly. How do you do, Viv? Nice to have you in Perth, Dennis said, as he let a bouncer go. He charged in and he bowled. The first ball was a bouncer, the second ball was a bouncer. There's another bouncer and that was a much better one and Dennis Lilly is obviously not going to give up this one without a fight because there's a test on here, you know, there's a test of supremacy. Uh, Dennis Lilly still considered perhaps the best bowler in the world and many consider Viv Richards the best batsman. I mean, one of them was a rip snorter. The other three were just bouncers. Um, and Viv, I think, was just a little bit cautious about the one that was a good one. Uh, and it was still on its way up when it got to me. Oops. And that's a big bouncer by Lilly then. <laughs> Viv Richards going for the hook. It was much too late as it flew by and... Rod Marsh, as you saw on the screen, had to get up high to take it. We asked the question, Bobby, will the umpires warm uh, Dennis Lilly for bowling too many bounces on over three out of three now? He'll have to be brave in Perth to do that, I think, Bill. The thing that I remember the most was the challenge against uh, Viv Richards. I mean, and here's an indication of how stupid administrators are. Um, you know, they've, they've taken the bouncer out of uh, the limited overs game. I see that they are now talking about bringing it back in at one per over. But here's Dennis Lilly. Four bounces on the trot. Four. He's got to be. He's got to be warned. What's what's the umpire? He's moved across, and he's warning Dennis Lilly. Yes, quite right. Dennis obviously bowled them on purpose, but yeah, because the pitch was slightly damp, I think Dennis said to the umpire Don Hawkes, "I'm not trying to, but my foot's slipping a little bit, uh, and I'll you know I'll try and keep him up." Uh, having no intention uh, whatsoever to change uh, the way he was going to bowl that day anyway. <laughs> that was well up there. Dennis had got him going, you know, uh, and, and, and it was just marvellous cricket. And, and, you know, to me that's the excitement of, uh, of the game of cricket. And it's certainly when you're a commentator and you've got a champion fast bowler against a champion batsman and they just lock horns. I mean, that is a, a fantastic scenario. Bobby. Dennis, in typical Dennis fashion, just sort of continued down the pitch and, and uh, kicked the stump. 